All right, I am super excited. It's finally here. I will be unboxing the Retroid Pocket 4 Pro. Um, I will leave the link for their website in the description. Um, so uh, the total came out to be 242 for it. Um, I ordered it on January 28th of 2024 <clears throat> and I received it today February 10th so it took approximately 14 days um, so two weeks and there you have it Retroid Pocket um, also so it took 14 days. I live in Oregon. So that gives you perspective. Um, I got the case with it. I got the case and also I got uh, the handle with it as well. The grip. Um, I went to their website and just today when I originally bought it they did not have an option to add a screen protector um, I did not pre-order this so I don't think I'm gonna have a screen protector with it um, let me know uh, what screen protector I can buy for this um, I got the black. I saw the clear one and it did not look like it was going to go good with the color that I bought my Retroid Pocket for. Let me open this up. Okay. Um, yep, yeah, it did not come with the screen protector. Um, when I ordered it, there was no option to add the screen protector. And right now I went to their website and they added that feature. I think for $5 extra you can add the screen protector, which I wish the option would have been available when I purchased it, but it wasn't. So here it comes. I got the crystal pocket four. Let's have a look at it. Oh, I lied. There is a screen protector. Awesome. I was gonna be a little disappointed if they didn't if it didn't come with one, but it did. Nice. And this is what I've been waiting for. Nice. These are definitely uh, a little small on the small side. Hopefully, um, it doesn't get annoying playing with these for a while. This also seems a little on the small side, but. As long as it lets me play my games, I don't think I'll have too much issues with it. The home, back, uh, select, start, and the triggers. Nice. Um... I mean, I like it. I like how it feels. It's not too heavy. Let me try it out with the uh, grip. Definitely gives it 
uh, more width um, with the grip it does feel a little bit more comfortable I have a little bit of room to move my hands out and have both thumbs on the joysticks um, yeah I'm definitely excited to start putting games in this and let me uh, get closer with the camera nice um, also I bought <clears throat> This Samsung memory card, 512 gigabytes. Um, there wasn't a lot of videos on what people were using for this. So I did a little bit of research and found that this one will, will work fine. But I would definitely um, put it in and see if it holds up. The games properly if it plays properly um, yeah we'll see how it goes I mean I'm gonna be playing a lot of Nintendo games um, from GameCube to um, the NES and some PlayStation Vita I saw PlayStation 2 not a lot of games would work properly um, so I don't plan to use it for that, but I might put some PS2 games in here if it lets me. Um, and yeah, uh, when I bought it, there was an app that allowed me to track where it was coming from. It's called Shop. Um, I don't know if that's standard, but that's the app that they that it kind of prompted me to to um, track my Retroid pocket four and its whereabouts um so i'm gonna definitely uh do a follow-up video to see how i like it to see how it holds up and yeah i'm i'm excited uh to try this thing out <clears throat>